Melissa Joan Hart recently opened up about a nerve-wracking incident during her time on Sabrina the Teenage Witch, where a magazine photo shoot almost led to her being sued and fired from the popular show. The accomplished actor, known for her role in the sitcom spanning seven seasons from 1996 to 2003, found herself in hot water after gracing the cover of men's magazine Maxim in October 1999. The magazine's cover boldly proclaimed, Sabrina, your favorite witch without a stitch. The intention behind the photo shoot was to promote the romantic comedy Drive Me Crazy, yet it inadvertently brought about allegations that Hart had violated the terms of her contract. The contract stipulated that she would never play the character naked, a condition that was seemingly breached due to the suggestive cover line of the magazine. Speaking candidly about this incident on the podcast Pod Meets World, Hart recounted the turning point. She recalled being approached by her lawyer during an after-party following the New York premiere of the film. At the party, my lawyer shows up and goes, you did a photo shoot for Maxim magazine? I'm like, yes, I did. They're like, well, you're being sued and fired from your show, so don't talk to the press, don't do anything, Hart shared. A tense phone call from her mother and the show's producer followed, expressing their dismay and seeking an explanation. Hart explained, I don't know, whatever my publicist told me to do at the photo shoot. I did a photo shoot for Maxim. It's Maxim, of course you're gonna be in your underwear. When the podcast hosts, including Danielle Fischel, Ryder Strong, and Will Friedel, inquired about potential legal repercussions, Hart responded, no, nothing came of it. They had no ground to stand on. Hart further explained, I wrote an apology letter and it was all gone. Reflecting on that challenging period, Hart described it as the worst day of my life. Not only was she grappling with the fallout from the photo shoot, but she was also dropped from a role in the horror spoof scary movie and had experienced a breakup with her boyfriend. The year 1999 saw the successful release of Drive Me Crazy, which garnered attention at the box office. Part of the film's popularity was attributed to the inclusion of the track Crazy by Britney Spears on the movie's soundtrack. Hart's revelation sheds light on the behind-the-scenes challenges that actors can face in the entertainment industry, even when unintentionally straying into controversial territory.